searching for the good in our neighborhoods and each other. Not just finding what's wrong, but what's right. A true reflection of Cincinnati. Find the good in your mornings. Good morning, Tri-State. Thanks for joining us for WCPO 9 News. I'm Julie O'Neill. Here's a look at some of the day's top stories. Good news in the global fight against COVID-19 may just happen in our own backyard. St. Elizabeth in Fort Thomas is the first hospital site in the world to start dosing patients as part of a new FDA approved trial. This drug called Pol 042 is designed to keep COVID symptoms from advancing and our healthcare system from getting overwhelmed. It works on receptors in the lungs to boost immunity. The trial will likely take about four months and then face other rounds of testing before it would be approved for the general public. Happening today, Cincinnati City Council holds a special meeting to discuss taking action to cap food delivery fees. If approved, Uber Eats and DoorDash and other such services would only be able to charge 15% for delivering their food. Right now, the companies can charge up to 30%. The family of a missing Highland County teen is asking for your help to find her. Madison Bell's mother says the 18-year-old left their home to go tanning Sunday morning, but Highland County Sheriff deputies do not believe she ever made it there. After finding her car at a local church near the tanning business, they found Madison's phone in the car with the keys still in the ignition. If you know anything as to her whereabouts, you're asked to call the Highland County Sheriff's Office at 937-393-1421. Jennifer. A flash flood watch continues here in the Tri-State. I mean, even to start the day, we had flash flood warnings at times for Hamilton County and down into northern Kentucky. So please be aware of that flash flooding is going to be in the cards today because we are overly saturated at this point. The temperature will barely move today, staying in the mid to low 60s all day long, and the rain will also be here all day. Rounds of rain throughout the morning drive leading to hydroplaning and unfortunately accidents here in the tri-state that will continue at noon and well throughout even the evening drive home. Expect the slowdowns. Rain will be here to stay for the day.